Hey guys, I got a little something different today. Um, still in the FG, as you can see. Uh, going down to fiddle with the ED over Christmas and probably rip all the turbo stuff off and uh, go back to square one with that. But um, in the meantime, a friend of mine's got a couple of E series uh, and he's just sent me a video of something he's been working on with one of them. It's a EB Fairmont V8 one. And uh, he's decided to chuck a um, an Android tablet uh, to replace the stereo. So he's got he's taken the stereo out, extended all the wires, and mounted a head unit under the driver's seat, and uh, mounted the tablet in the dash, and and um, run from the headphone jack to the aux input of the stereo. Uh, so he's got a touchscreen, uh, Spotify, YouTube. Netflix, all that good stuff, and um, yeah, control everything from there. So he sent me a couple of videos just kind of running through the setup, uh, so you can kind of see how it sits in the car, and and uh, he kind of explains uh, how it gets power, and um, and the app that there's an app on it that uh, will will put the tablet to sleep when the ignition's off. And um, and turn it back on uh, once the ignition's on and it gets power. It uh, opens the app, screen comes on, and it's it's all ready to go. So sorry, uh, updates have been pretty slow recently. Um, hope to just get some updates of where the EDs are over Christmas, and I've also got a few little updates on my mate's car, uh, the ELXR6. So. But anyway, after Christmas, I'll, I'll definitely have some more videos up uh, as soon as I can. Just uh, updating on, on where uh, everyone's project is at. In the meantime, check out this first video of my mate's V8 EB Fairmont. There should be plenty more to come in the future. He's got, yeah, big plans for, for both his E-Series. So, yeah, get some extra content there. Also, thank you for watching. And... Yeah, I'll have some updates soon. Okay, finally, finally finished the Nexus tablet into the dash of my EB Fairmont. Um, it's it's pretty easy to do. Uh, just sort of cut out the fascia as much as you can with the with the Dremel. Um, in the back here is behind it is a USB 3.1 amp twin USB port that's behind there that runs power to here. Um, I drilled through here to put a 3.5 cable. Now that all runs, the 3.5 runs under here, under the, under through the console to, underneath this seat is a Pioneer head unit, um, with just running the AUX on AUX on auxiliary. Um, also got another 3.5 cable coming through here, which charges my phone. Um so that you can tether the internet. Now, <clears throat> let's turn, let's go in sleep mode, but that's the screen that's currently connected to the internet through through my phone. Um, but it also runs another app called Automate, uh, which runs off the ignition, so when power comes on, when power comes off. So right now the auxiliary is on to accessories, so I'll just turn it off. Now it's not charging. I'm gonna turn it back on. And Automate automatically opens. So it opens up sort of like a car friendly and music will start playing. If you had music playing previously, it'll just pick up right where it left off. Um, this is the navigation, phone, That's the phone main screen, so you've got your weather, blah blah blah, and then favorites is like YouTube, and I've got Spotify and Stan and stuff, so and Chrome. So go back to the home screen. So t the way it's set up, it's meant to work that I turn the key once I turn the key off, it should put it into sleep mode again. So we'll just see. Yep, there you go. And then turn it back on. App reopens. 
and uh, it should pick back up playing music. There you go. <clears throat> okay, I'll pause the music. Now, uh, also, you scroll up and hit that. Now it's back to the main screen. You've also got like, well, anything Android, really. So, all of it in there. It's, it's relatively good. YouTube, blah, blah, blah. It all kind of works like Spotify. I'll just chuck that on. I tend to use Spotify a lot. And um, I can pick up my playlist, so uh, yes, I'm into metal, don't kill me. Best music ever. Metalcore playlist, or oh, go back, deathcore playlist. Uh, I'll go back to what I was playing. And all of this is being played and streamed through on my phone so uh, hit that should be working like with the android tablet I guess you have hit and miss times when things don't want to work properly but it's pretty considering how much a tablet costs these days and what it costs for um, there you go, I'll just turn the head unit a little bit um, the tablet's so much cheaper than going out and buying a head unit that has Android in it so yeah, also, if you're going to do it the way I've done it, you have to um, obviously make a custom sort of loom for the head unit. So I just bought a bunch of wires from JCAR that sort of all colour-coded and wired them into the plug and ran them all underneath here, and then they go come out down the bottom here. Um, I'll show you the head unit. The head unit's down here. You need to see the wires there. Um... Yeah, it's, for the most part it works really really well kids jumped in the back and were watching videos on it and streaming stuff and so on so you know it's it's awesome um, really stoked with it hope you dig it <laughs>